Uh, yeah, we just watched them today. Uh, they're like really aggressive attacking the basket. Uh, don't have too much size, but they all they all can make plays for themselves, driving to the hoop, and you know, creating for each other. So, I feel like you big guys like you, Mike, Alonzo, and, and even Sheldon are all pretty interchangeable. I mean, is there much emphasis that you guys put on who's the five, who's the four, stuff like that? Uh, yeah, I think that's one of our strengths. You know, uh, we have five big guys that can play. That's what coach always says. So, um, we rotate through, and I think four and five primarily. Uh, are in the same spot, so I think it helps us because a lot of us can run both four and five. So, is it even better for you personally? Because I don't know if in high school if you ever even thought of yourself as a, a center, a five man, and now you come to college and that's more or less where you're playing, I guess, right? Uh, yeah, I, it's kind of weird if you're thinking about it that way, but um, just um, both positions give you a chance to get on the floor and play, and they're primarily the same. So I'm just. Just fill in wherever you can. Do you like do you, do you like playing eight or one? It doesn't matter to you. Do uh, you feel like one make ask you to do something a little different than the other? Uh, I feel like the five you're obviously guarding their best, usually their best post player. So I feel like I've improved in my post defense. So uh, when I get to the five, I know that's what I'm gonna need to be doing. And then four, obviously a little bit more stepping out and uh, involved more in screening and everything. So. I, was gonna say, like, I guess in your case, if say you and Mike are, are in there inside, I mean, you're pretty much guarding the other team's big man, right? But offensively, you guys are doing similar things? Um, yeah, I'd say if me and Mike are in there, he's primarily the four, usually. Mm -hmm. But um, like you said, that flexibility kind of makes it easy to play with. And, you know, and sometimes it's, I like guarding the bigger guy and, you know, p playing post defense. So. Coach talked about you guys. Yeah, they um I guess last year you couldn't do the arm bar and this year you can. So I've it was kinda tricky at first to, you know, stay balanced and use that arm bar, but I think I've adjusted pretty well. Still need to get better. But um uh, as far as like the arm bar, it's kind of hard to stay balanced and you know keep that pressure on them. But I think I'm adjusting pretty well. Is it a big difference to go from playing the big guys on Gonzaga and then playing uh, you know a much smaller team in St. Joe's? And I guess tomorrow night will be probably a little more in between. Yeah, because against Gonzaga, obviously they, what they had on basically two or three seven footers. So uh, playing against like the smaller teams, it was weird defending maybe against like a six four, six five, six six post guy. You know, try to get into your leg. So. It is a bit of an adjustment, but it's still same post defense. So, was it all tough for you guys to get up for that game Tuesday? I mean, after uh, all the travel and everything, and, and you know, playing a team that's it's not even Division One, was it hard at all, or just, did it feel like you were rusty a little or anything? Um, I I think we had good energy throughout the game, so I don't think that was a part of it. But um, maybe just like the travel and like people catching up on their sleep patterns, or whatever, was kind of difficult. But I think anytime we have a game. People are usually just ready, but it was kind of different.